What is up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the Geek Fuel for this month. So again, there's no themes for Geek Fuel. Um, the box is a little damaged, but hopefully everything will be A-OK. -okay. Um, so again, like I said, no themes, so I have no clue what anything will be in here. So of course we have our magazine, which we will look at, so it's got Spider-Man, so it could have some Spider-Man stuff, maybe not. Um, let's start with the shirt. Um, okay, so it looks like we have a brown shirt, which brown's never good. But it is a Firefly Serenity, and it says, You can't take the sky from me, so of course their whole little tagline thing. And so this looks a lot like our Atari shirt we got, like last month or whatever, but of course with the um, Firefly Serenity ship. It's got some of the, like, Japanese, Chinese writing, whatever. Mandarin. Mandarin there, which is Chinese. And then, of course, the whole logo and Serenity established at 2517, you can't take the sky from me type thing. So that's really cool. Um, but like I said, I don't like the brown color at all for this. It's, I don't like brown shirts. <laughs> um, but it's still pretty cool. Um, so that's awesome. And I know bro like that. Because if you didn't know, we do unboxings of the Firefly cargo crate. Um, I have no clue or don't know much of it all about. But they're all bros things and um so he'll love that shirt obviously um let's go we have a little kid robot thing here it's a street fighter 5 and we have a vinyl minifigure um so of course um there's characters so it looks like what uh ken um chin chun -Li Chun -Li. or whatever and then i have no clue who that is at all and then on the back here there's all the figures that we could get i don't know if because usually these are exclusives may not be for this one um so it could just be any of those characters but let's open it and see which character we got hopefully it's someone cool and not someone I don't need. so let's open it and see so we got <laughs> funny we got chun li from the box or whatever so of course this is the like um girl from uh street fighter i always remember playing as her in the game I don't know why, I just always remembered her. She was always um, a popular character and stuff. And so, yeah, see, she looks different than the box, but it's just like she's in a dark blue outfit, where in the box she's in a very light blue. Um, so I didn't know if this was like a variant or something like that. But yeah, that is cool. I don't really know who I'd like besides maybe Ken and Ryu, because I know them the best. And Vega, obviously. Dulcim. Yeah, he, um, I think that's him on there. They look kind of weird on the box, but that's pretty cool. I mean, it's a real, it's like squishy, like, I mean, it's soft. You can like squish and stuff. That's still kind of cool, um, but that's awesome. And so next up we have a, something from Donkey Kong. It is a barrel cooler, so I assume it's like a cup cozy type thing. Um, so let's look at it, open it up here real quick. So this is one thing I like a lot about Geek Fuel. I mean, they have stuff like, I probably never use this. But this is still kind of cool how, you, you know, it's a barrel, obviously, it's a foam or whatever, you start, I don't know what you call it, but you can just stick like a can of something like a soda or something down in there and then just drink from it. And that's, so that's really cool. Like I said, they have a lot of neat and like different I like items and that's what I like. Like this is pretty cool. Like I said, probably won't use it because I don't use any like cans of soda or anything like that. Um, but I could maybe find something else for it and I like it and like I said very cool and interesting and that's one thing I really like about Geek Fuel. Next up we have our Steam code and it is for Steam Roll, a steampunk adventure and puzzle game. And again I've still never played any of these and really want to. Um, so there's no like characters, usually they have like you know like pictures of characters and stuff like that but this does not have anything um, on it. It just says puzzle, so I don't know if it's where you're not playing as a character you just do random stuff or not but that's still um, Cool, I like how they include those. Like I said, never played any of them, but I want to. And then we have our pin for the month. And again, they continue on with this. And of course, Bro will have this one. It is Thundercats. And so it's called Lion Epic Enamels, as this one called Thunderclaps Edition. And so we have yeah, a lion -O here. Um, let's see. So it says, um, there's all sorts of stuff trying to like see what it says. So it says, real enamel finish with super shiny um, surface. There, I thought it was like a thing. This has um, two rare pins with a snarf and um, the mumra type thing or whatever. And so on the back we have Lion Bot, which is this one. Then you could get Panthrover, um, Shitara, or Shitara. I don't know exactly what that is. And then, of course, um, Snarf Fuel and Mum Rover are the others. So there's all that. Again, I love these, how 
much detail and um, creativity they put into all of these pins. I'm sad they because they so didn't awesome. give Tigra any love. Um, I don't know. Um, but that's still really cool. And then, so that is everything. So, of course, we have our card, which we'll look through. So, on the front there, we have our Serenity shirt that, of course, we got. So, hopefully, Brad will like that one and wear it, actually. Um, then we have, our, of course, our pin, which we got the um, lion -O or lion bot or whatever they called it. We got the Steamroll Steam Game, the Street Fighter character, and it shows um, Balrog or whatever his name is. Zengief. Is it? Yeah. Oh. Well, whoever. It shows Rock's the boxer. It, oh, yeah. It shows him. It says, strike a fighting pose and don't forget Hadouken. Um, so that's cool. And then, of course, the barrel cooler. And Chun Lee can just go inside there. Um, so that was all pretty awesome. So before we get to the last thing, let's look through our magazine here. So, um, with Spider Man, of course, Spider Man Homecoming, which you can re watch our review that we did on it. Um, but of course, we have our barrel cooler. Um, there, then of course a bunch of Street Fighter um, characters, Spider-Man costumes, Batman, oh because of Adam West, um, Death, they put a memorum thing, Steamroll game, so some more little information about the game, then of course all their cool um, Ultimate Geek Guide gifts, which I like looking through these, seeing all the cool items they have, like an 8-bit fireplace, I mean, who, who wouldn't want that, a Nintendo, can, old classic Nintendo pool float, I mean, it's so awesome. Um, <laughs> Corey, you don't. Oh, and then we have pictures here. And we are not in it yet. We've been in it once, so like I said, probably the odds of viewing it a whole bunch of times is rare. But um, I always check just to make sure, but we're not in that one. But that's going to be it for the Geek Fuel. So what was your favorite item out of this box, bro? Oh, it's a toss-up between the lion pin and the Serenity shirt. I somewhat assume, because obviously... Two things you love a lot, Serenity and Thundercats. Um, I'm probably going to say the Thundercats. Um, like I said, I really like this barrel just because it's creativity, but I don't really have any use. Like I said, I'll be able to come up with something to use for it, but probably this pin because I love these so much. I wish more boxes did stuff like this, like took some like logo or something and turned it into... Um, like different stuff like Thundercats. But that's going to be it for this Geek Fuel unboxing. So if you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. Leave any comments you have down below. And hit that red subscribe button to see more. And we'll see you next time.